Now for question um, 18b, I have to draw a cumulative frequency graph for this table. So I'm just going to take this table, copy it, and I just pasted it onto the next part of my question. Uh, just remember that I need to plot some points here to get like an S curve, right? This kind of shape. So I definitely don't know going to need this. And I'm just going to basically plot the points. Now when I look at my scale, uh, there is a little bit of um, um, thinking to do. So if you remember, so this would be 10, and this would be 10 as well. And then between 0 and 10, between 0 and 10, there are only five boxes, which means that every single teeny tiny box is actually worth two units. Because if you think about it, it would be 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So the first point would be uh, amount spent is pounds right here. So just remember that the first number is going to go into your x-axis, yeah? It's 2018. So 2018 is right here. So first point. Second point is 4040. Not much confusion here. Then 6075 will be 6075. Now, if you think about it, that's 70. That's 72, 74, like right in the bill 75. Then we are 80, 90. 80, 90 will be between 80 and 100. There you go. They got 198, 198 would be just before uh, the 100, and then 120, 100. Notice that the shape, I'm going to try my best to draw it, but you know, if you can obviously do a better job than I am. I can even join the zero with this, it doesn't matter. Uh, I want this time, so, and then, well, not too bad. I, mean, I can join this with zero as well, but there's no need. Okay, so that's your cumulative frequency uh, graph.